Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and this is a quick video to talk about one of the new features coming in the Creators Update that um, I think uh, is worth talking about a little bit. So right now, you know, if you try to find any security settings in your computer, uh, well, if you go here, you don't really find nothing that's related to security, there's privacy. And if you search for Cortana or if you type security here, um, well, you have Windows Defender settings, Windows updates, um, and the security and maintenance is basically pretty much all in the good old control panel. And that looks really drab and very horrible. This is, a, a, you know, it, it tells you the basics, firewalls on, virus protections on, uh, stuff like that. Doesn't mean anything really. And, uh, it, it that that needed to change and I think there's a step forward in this new panel that Microsoft is actually introducing in the creators update um, I mean it's it's a good effort it's a nice place to put everything yet there's maybe a few things you know um, Microsoft is an all-or-nothing company and what I find in antiviruses in general for example is that they have too many things running, you know? So uh, as a tech guy, you know, I'll go to a client and then the client's gonna say, oh, uh, I get this pop-up that says my computer's running slow and maybe you should, shoot, you should do this or that. And typically it's most of the time the antivirus that now has a module to try to help you to make your computer faster. Um, you know, there's too much stuff in antiviruses today, really too much, I mean, the panel should be so simple as you're protected, your firewall's on, and if you want to change settings or you know do a scan or do something, click here. And Microsoft is, I think, falling in that category of, oh, we'll do a panel to help you with your security, but they kind of overdo it. So, for example, here, you know, I find it really cool that there's a virus and threat protection shield firewall and network protection that's okay but you know what that should have stayed the minimum of that I do not really like a device performance and health in this panel because one of the biggest issues with that is the computers I have often have a lot of difficulty understanding what's a performance issue so as a computer gets older you get alerts of, oh, your device performance and health is not good. You need to do something. And typically, there's often nothing to do because the computer's just getting older and it is getting slower. So, I'm, you know, I don't know. Device and performance and health has nothing to do with your security center. It has nothing to do with the security of your computer. I'm not sure this should be in here. App and browser control... Um, it's not very clear that it's for security. It just says app in browser control. So, um, you know, you're using recommended settings. What does that mean? We have no idea. Not very clear what that does, you know. So, um, hmm. That is also something that I'm not sure is or needs to be in this security center. It's not, I don't see a security issue when I look at app and browser control and finally finally options manage your family um, how your family uses the device it is also not necessarily a security option um, you know maybe the uh, family options should go back to where they were in in, in um, user accounts that's pretty much where you want to play with family options look at user accounts and do things like that so um, I think Microsoft is uh, you know of course making a, a great effort in, in creating this new panel but it's overdoing it it's putting maybe a little too much information and too much stuff and things that you know device performance and health has nothing to do with security and app and browser control Maybe, but it's not very clear, and I'm not sure that's what you have in the security stuff. I don't know. Uh, you know, this panel should have virus and threat protection, 
firewall and network protection and uh, I don't know a big check mark that says hey all of your security options are on and working you know clearly um, because this is just gonna you know confuse people and I can see myself as a tech guy having to deal with oh well uh, it says my app and browser controls are not okay yeah but that depends on what you chose and what you're doing with your PC it might be that yeah well they're not what's recommended because you personalized them or an app personalized them for you device performance and health I can already see oh it says that my computer is running slow that you need to do something well it can run slow and it po it is possible that because it's older or because of what you're doing it's running slow and there's really nothing you can do about it so uh, and it's not has nothing to do with security so I don't know um, overdoing it maybe but at least let's give them a thumbs up to the fact that they are concentrating all of that in a uh, security center in Windows 10 so that was my rant and um, I don't know what do you think of this new uh, security panel what's okay or not in there and here and uh, do you like the fact that now everything would be in creators update in one security center like this if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up if you have any comments questions suggestions let us know and uh, give me your feedback on this uh, I'd like to know what you think and uh, it's always fun to have all of your comments and suggestions